Did you ever wonder where your cats came from before they were rescued? This fluffy kitten was living on the street, scrounging for food in the garbage. Kittens at this age are expected to fend for themselves, which means mom is no help, even when you really need advice. She was almost at the end of the socialization window. If this kitten is going to have a good life indoors, we need to move quickly. Eventually, rescue volunteers were able to lure her into a carrier with food, and we spayed mom and several other cats to end the cycle on this block. Change can be scary, even when you're moving on to bigger and better things. We named her Tibby. Thanks to your help, she got the vaccines and medical care she needed and was placed with a foster volunteer. And after fending for herself outside, Tibby was about to start braving the indoor elements. Having been a scavenger her whole life, she couldn't understand the concept of her very own bowl of food. It seemed too good to be true, and without mom around for advice, Tibby was on her own to make a decision. Not every rescued cat needs a bath, but Tibby had been rolling around trash bags. She was starting to get the hang of enjoying new things. Playtime presented another challenge. Tibby had been in survival mode her whole life. She never had the luxury of being silly or enjoying playtime with toys. A year earlier, another fluffy gray cat had been looking for help nearby. This is LG. We rescued him and found a loving family who could provide all the comforts of home. Life was good. And then one day, his parents found a little gremlin in the trash. LG needed to try something new too. Following a slow and careful introduction process, they first met through the door. Later, they shared the occasional meal. And a lot of things that LG was used to doing alone now came with a sidekick. Eventually, Tibby won LG over. And he reluctantly embraced his role as older brother and mentor. They had the same story after all. LG knew exactly what Tibby went through. He helped her play and adjust to the comforts of indoor life. And when Tibby wondered what could have been, she had LG to remind her that they are the lucky ones. We wish every cat rummaging through the trash could eventually find the love and comforts of home. But the reality is there are more cats than resources available. And that's especially true during kitten season and the spring and summer months. During this time, thousands of kittens like Tibby are born outside every year. It takes a lot of work to get even one cat healthy and ready for adoption. Multiply that by several thousand and we have an overpopulation crisis. This shouldn't be a problem at all in the wealthiest city in the world. That's why you helped us open our affordable nonprofit clinic, Flatbush Vet, allowing New Yorkers to access affordable vet care for their pets. 
so fewer cats like Tibby are suffering outside. As a foster kitten, Tibby was only supposed to be here for a few weeks, but it wasn't long before these two were inseparable. Tibby's foster parents weren't initially thinking about adoption, but Tibby and LG made the decision for them. From scrounging for garbage to living in the lap of luxury with her very own Flatbush Cat's brother, Tibby's story is the best we can hope for. Because of your support, these two will never scavenge for a meal ever again. They will only know soft beds, warm snuggles, and the love that I know you believe every cat deserves. Thank you for making this possible. <laughs>